Hi guys. So here I am today with a mystery package. <laughs> it's New Year's Eve and this just arrived and I think, mm, I think that this is a mad purchase that I did online. It has to be two months ago. You know all those adverts you get on Facebook for companies like um, Flory Day and strange names like that and I've always avoided them. Late one night I thought I'd done an order but when nothing came after X number of weeks I thought you've dreamt it, you've dreamt it and I am one of those people that will go on these sites and look and go mm, that sounds good but never actually go any further so I didn't give it any more thought until this arrived with the Chinese writing on it addressed to me. So it has to be. It's come express from China, but it's taken over two months. So um, I'm gonna open it up with you, see what it is, and see, uh, was it worth waiting two months for? My name's Fawn, this is my channel. I do lots of unboxings and hauls and chats and things. And um, it's a happy place with some lovely people. So if you would like to join me, please do give me a thumbs up, click subscribe and leave a comment. The subscriptions really do help the channel guys. I know it just seems silly, but so I'm gonna ask. <laughs> Here we go. So I really don't know. When I took this out of the post box, I thought, what on earth is this? I haven't done another one from Shein. And it's not Shein packaging. But, a bit like she and some of the parcels have got these uh, packages. So I've got one, two, three, four, five. And no paperwork whatsoever. Does it say anything on here? It really doesn't. Well, whatever they are, I'm clearly not going to be able to send them back. So wish me luck. So first up is quite vibrant, kind of a paisley-ish. <laughs> Me and nighttime shopping. It's not good, it's not good. You know when you just can't sleep and you sit up in bed for like the, you know, what seems like the hundredth time during the night? I'm bad for that and that's when I start wandering around on Facebook. Okay, this is a blouse. <laughs> um, <laughs> I can't believe I would ever order this, but what would I say? Okay, let's just try and break it down like I did like it. Um, it may look really nice on, smells fine. I don't know why I bothered to sniff it, but I did. I bought it in an extra large. It's a very sort of, um, I was gonna say satin fabric, but it's not shiny like satin, but it's got that feel. Um, are there any? <laughs> Do you know there's not a label in this? There's not a label. There's not a washing instructions. There's no <laughs> oh, I really have gone off piece, haven't I? Do you know? No, nope, there's not a washing instruction. There's not a what it's made of. There's not a right. So <laughs> that's number one. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> okay, this is a grey. It feels like t-shirty fabric, so this I might have more chance with this. It says, it's fine, I'm fine, everything's fine. That's quite fun. Grey, long sleeve, oh it's got that drop shoulder business going on which I may not like. Um, it has pockets on the side. I quite like the slogan. That would be alright for lounging around in, wouldn't it? I can't even tell you how much these things were because there was no paperwork whatsoever, but they won't have been a lot. Um, okay, next we have, this is one of the ones that comes in a little Ziploc bag. This is, is there anything? Do you know there's nothing? There is nothing to tell me who it's from or how much I paid. <laughs> Oh dear. Okay, this is a black. Oh, that's quite nice. A black long sleeve. I was gonna say t-shirt, but it's got cuffed sleeves. It's square necked. It's got this little bit of 
Okay, I hope that's coming across. A little bit of, I was going to say embroidery. It's not embroidery, but you know what I mean. It's got an edging. That's quite nice. That... <laughs> For layering. It's such a mystery. It is such a mystery. I won't be doing this again, I tell you. <laughs> um, oh, oh dear. Oh, now this is shine. <gasps> oh. There is no way. There is no way on this God's earth that this is what I ordered. I, I mean, I just, there is no way. Um, it's long, it has pockets. It's kind of, I don't know if you can tell, it's kind of shiny, a bit like, um, you know, like football shirts, that kind of shiny. Um, no, there's no way I ordered this, so, I mean, I've obviously put in an order and they're just fulfilling it. I had that happen once before. I ordered, um, I don't know if you know the cartoon character Bing Bunny. I ordered a Bing Bunny um, plate, bowl and cup set for my one grandson who was Bing Mad. And I waited ages and ages and ages and eventually they delivered me a scarf. And I thought, what earth is going on? I then started researching. And apparently they don't break the law. If, so long as they send you something. If they don't send you anything at all, just take your money, then they can get into a lot of trouble. But if they provide you with something, they can then go, oh, it was a mistake. But you've got to front the postage to send it back. And they know you won't. Not to China. So, um, yes. I did get stung once before. And I'm getting a little bit stung here, I think. But it does serve me right for shopping in the middle of the night. Oh, and this is heavy. This is a heavy one. This is the last one. <laughs> I'm going to end 2020 the way the year has been, I think. <laughs> Bumpy, not knowing what's going on. What did I do? It's a very 2020 feeling. And this is... Oh, my... <laughs> this is a... Camouflage, uh, long-sleeved top. <laughs> with, <laughs> with, there's no way I ordered this. There's just no way. Even in the middle of the night, I wouldn't be this mad. With camouflage trousers. remember the things that I would not in detail but they do some well <laughs> the photos on the site do some really pretty sort of casual tops um <laughs> there's no way I ordered any of this oh, oh dear so um and these are meant to be extra large can you see that waist ladies that is the smallest waist I've ever seen oh, anyway there they are <laughs> and because it's New Year's Eve, I'm actually going to try these on. <laughs> oh, definitely I'm ending 2020 well. <laughs> okay. <laughs> very little girl when nylon became a big thing I mean look at this Flory Day I looked it up it's Flory Day F-L-O-R-Y D-A-Y the sleeves are too long the bottom is too tight I mean as you can tell I'm losing the fight here the fabric <laughs> I feel like doing you know nah. Fever, not fever. <laughs> um, it's hideous. Okay, guys, this one isn't too bad. I've got to be fair. It's not too bad. It's comfortable. The fabric is, you know, stretchy. I quite like this square neckline. I think that's quite flattering. Um, you know, I'm not looking my best at the moment. I've gained a ton of weight. So, but... I mean, I don't know what I paid for it. So, um, I'll show you. It is a bit clingy, but again, that's my body. This one, 
I'm not sure. I'll have to watch this back. I'm with a different outfit. I'm thinking with a skirt. I think this one might be quite nice. I still didn't order it. Or maybe I did. But I definitely... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here, guys. <laughs> uh, buying from China. Hmm. Maybe I spoke too soon. I quite like this. Don't think I'd ever go out in it. But... For wandering around the house, being casual, um, I quite like it. It's almost sort of dress length. There's lots of room in it. I mean, it's bound to be clinging, you know. I'm a churchy girl at the minute. I like the pockets, very handy. Um, the sleeves are slightly odd, you know, having this puff thing. If I come in, can you see? They're sort of puffy and then they go tight to the arm. But it's not hideous. Um, would I have bought it? Don't think I would. Is it an abomination? No, I, I, I could wear it and use it and, and so on. So I've got to be fair, this one is not quite so bad. So the black one and this one, not so bad. The first one, horrific. Oh, we've got that camouflage set coming up soon. <laughs> Okay, um, again, I don't think it's <sighs> horrific. I don't think it does anything for me. The sleeves, as you can see, are very jazzmatazz, very jazzmatazz. But then it's got this high neck, plain black body. Has got pockets. Again, it's almost as long as a dress. Um, yes, it's going to have lumps and bumps, ladies. <laughs> would I wear it uh, I don't think so not even for cleaning this one I, I just feel this is straight to the charity shop for me but it's not as bad I'm so dreading, I'm so dreading what's coming I'm dreading that camouflage set what a way to welcome in the new year um, so yeah that's that one um, <laughs> And here we go. What do you think? G.I. Jane? <laughs> I looked in the mirror, I was like, <laughs> okay, what can I say? His long sleeves. It's not a bad fit, I don't suppose, with my, my body issues. I don't suppose. <laughs> Um, the trousers aren't that bad, although the elastic is incredibly tight. They've put a really tight piece of elastic in there for no good reason that I can figure out. Um, they have pockets. <laughs> oh my God. Um, someone's bound to put in the comments, it doesn't look that bad for them. Honestly, girls, I don't know that the camera is going to give you a lot honest... Um, <laughs> And I'll listen to of what this looks like. This fabric is shiny, like the kids wear for, you know, their, their um, football t-shirts, you know, the ones you buy. It's that shiny stuff. I am sweating. I mean, I, I run hot, but oh my God, this is what, I, what do I look like? What do I look like? Oh dear. That's what I get for shopping at night <laughs> on a Chinese website like Floriday. So, um, yeah, that was that. <laughs> I've still got it on. Um, I just want to say a happy new year to everybody. You know, it's New Year's Eve and at some point you're going to be counting down or you'll be in bed fast asleep, which I will probably be. I have to say I'm not a big New Year's Eve, but then I don't drink. So it becomes an exercise in watching other people get drunk usually so i think i'll just be happy to say goodbye to 2020 and if it passes and goes while i'm fast asleep that suits me just fine but i want you all to have a fabulous time and to have a fabulous 2021 now lots of you will have noticed that i reached 620 
seven, I think, subscribers, and I haven't announced my giveaway. Well, I'm announcing it now. I thought, a great way to start the new year. I hung back a bit. I had a weird feeling that over Christmas, because I wasn't doing vlogs, um, and because, you know, my content hadn't changed very much, I thought I might lose quite a lot of subscribers. So I thought, well, I'll just wait and see what happens. Well, I, I have lost some, but I haven't lost as many as I might have done. So 628, so of course, there's a 600 giveaway. Um, I'm looking out the window and I'm, I'm trying to think of what word to use and I think, you know, it's a new year, it's going to be a new year. Um, I think maybe the word hope, put hope somewhere in there, put hope in your comment so that I know that you're with me in hoping, hoping and praying that next year is the year that we really need it to be because by God we've had a tough year this year. Um, and I just wanted you to know that I really care. I think you're all amazing. I love the cards, I love the letters, I love the comments. I read them all. I've been bad about commenting lately, you know, replying lately, but I do read them all. And things are returning to normal, thank God. My eldest has now gone back to London. Not that she was an issue, <laughs> but it was pretty chaotic. Um, she's gone back to London and uh, my younger daughter, her back is so much better. And I've had some time off. I've been able to regroup and recharge a little bit. I was feeling very drained. So I'm gonna be able to head into 2021 feeling great with ideas for the channel and just wanting to spend more time with you guys. So um, yeah, happy new year everybody. And I hope <laughs> that you all, um, you all get the year that you deserve. Sometimes we don't get what we deserve, do we? So I'm not gonna wish the most amazing things for you. I'm gonna wish you the year that you deserve, which, because you are all lovely, will be a lovely, lovely year. So I'll see you on the other side, guys, but um, you won't be seeing me wearing these, and you won't be seeing me trying any more mad Chinese fashion sites on Facebook, <laughs> okay? I love you all, I really do. Bye.